going to take just a few minutes to get the seventh and eighth graders up here, and they'll do their five selections. <laughs>
to celebrate um, the tradition of Hanukkah, but also um, the Jewish religion, and it's featuring the songs My Dreidel and Hava Nagila. Uh, and you're going to hear the melody bounce around from different sections within the band. Uh, you're going to hear us change tempos, do a little bit more with dynamics, and hopefully end it end together when we get to the conclusion. It gives you chills up your spine. Uh, this group really has a super attitude in, in rehearsal. They also diagnose, they're very good at diagnosing what they need to do. And I talked with some students today from yesterday, and if you should hear what they come up with that they're listening to and say, we need to improve on this. We need to improve on this. We can do better there. We did really well with this. We did really well with that. And that's that's very rare. And rehearsals have been a real pleasure. And I'm looking for that to continue. Uh, and then some impressive things that they'll be able to do in the spring. We have a couple of new students that joined this group. One uh, student from another district, one from our own district. And I want to recognize them, welcome them. Uh, the first 
Uh, person is Adit Singh. He is an alto sax player, and he came just across the road here from Pine Richland. So, a round of applause for Adit. Also joining this group even closer because he was in orchestra last year and now he's playing in the percussion section, Zach Musi. <laughs> While I'm uh, acknowledging some folks, I'd like all the members of the jazz ensemble to stand, be recognized. rehearsals in so far this year on Mondays and I don't let them play on the winter concert because I want to focus on fundamentals but they have a, quite a few performances uh, starting I think with the talent show coming up maybe I think that's in February and then on through the rest of the school year the next piece of music uh, well I'm probably older than a lot of the people in here uh, but in any event, if you remember Andy Williams, I know growing up I remember watching his shows on TV and even then I remember thinking, listen to the voice that this guy has. It was so smooth and the silky and he could just do all kinds of different things and it, looked, it sounded effortless. Well, he was the one that recorded this back in 1963. But it was also redone, and my mother would be upset with me if I didn't say this. It was redone by Johnny Mathis in 1986. And uh, this arrangement is really a wonderful arrangement, no pun intended. Uh, but it's going to feature our trumpets, and also our low brass gets featured in a, in a section in here. It's the most wonderful time of the year. recognize some students on stage, I should say some more students. Uh, about three, four weeks ago we had a group go to AV Honors Band auditions and we had something very unusual happen this year. 
never happened to me before. I really don't think it's ever going to happen again. But we had eight students go to audition, and all eight students made it. And let me recognize these eight. I'm going to have them stand when I call their name. Hold your applause to the end. Uh, first selected, Natalie Reese on the flute. Mason Brokus on oboe. Lauren Truitt on clarinet. Dan Longo and Andrew Long on alto saxophone. Ben Swihart on berry sax. Evan Greenberg on French horn. And Austin Ivanko on trumpet. Let me also point out that North Allegheny goes to AV Honors Band and we compete with seven other school districts. Um, and they compete against seventh, eighth, and ninth graders. And I want to recognize one young man that just stood up because not only did he make the band as a seventh grader, but he took down the top chair, first chair, and that's Dan Longo on the end. If you have looked into the program, there is a section there about dates, and I encourage you to take a look at those dates. There are a couple that need to be to be announced, and also I could actually add one to that. I just received word today that for those of you that like to plan really far in advance, especially the eighth graders that are going to be in marching band, summer band camp has been announced as August 5th through the 9th, and August 12th through the 16th. So if you want to plan your vacation around that or any other thing, those are the dates. I just received them today. So the next piece of music is arranged by Larry Clark. And Larry has a really unique way of taking two pieces of music, combining them together, and either making them really beautiful or really interesting and kind of quirky. Well, this one, He's done a masterful job of making it a beautiful piece of music. He has taken Gustav Holst in the bleak midwinter, and he's combined it with the carol, Angels We Have Heard On High. And when you talk about exposing students and sections, it doesn't get any more exposed than this piece of music. It's going to start off with our four eighth grade flute players starting this piece, and then we'll have a brass choir, woodwind choir, and then the flutes are going to finish up this piece. I hope you enjoy this. This is actually one of their favorites.